Hey everybody, it's Hope out in nature and I wanted to show you my beautiful little sun patience which I planted near my bell box and I'm going to zero in on these little guys and show you some amazing little water droplets. That's dew and that appeared overnight as a result of the temperature change here on earth and it's watering this plant without the plant even asking do from heaven to keep these little guys alive and you can see those little water beads all over the plant i love the concept of dew i love to go out in the morning and see dew on the grass and on my plants it's mentioned tons of time in scripture dew is d-e-w and if you want to see all the places in scripture that that God talks about do just Google do found in Scripture or Scripture mentioning do and you won't believe the references what I love about do is it's not showy it's not rain it's not a thunderstorm it's just these precious quiet little water droplets that show up on the things that need nourishment and it actually plays a bigger role in keeping plants alive than rainstorms and thunderstorms. It's not dramatic. It's just quiet little water droplets sent from God to nurture and to provide for um, the things that plants need. I'm reading right now from Psalm, excuse me, Proverbs 3, Proverbs 3 verses 19 and 20. By wisdom, the Lord laid the earth's foundations. By understanding, he set the heavens in place. By his knowledge, the deeps were divided and the clouds let drop the dew. God knows how to help us. He knows how to care for us. He knows to, what to provide while we sleep. Water droplets just show up and they're there in the morning and then they evaporate. If God will do that for the little plants, how much more will he provide for us? Actually, he is providing for us by keeping plants alive. We need plants to live. Praise God, the sender of the dew. <laughs>